ass kick. I don't got any fucking weapons, but I'll still beat that ass all up and down the street. Ooh, play cool, play cool, play cool. I got a gun on me, though. You don't want to fuck with me. Hello everyone and welcome back to DOJ. Today we are doing, I have no idea, again, we're just kind of getting in here with no sense of anything on what I want to do. A few things I want to go over, if my room sounds a little echoey like I'm in a cave, uh, it's because it, my room is now my office, um, and I'm still kind of getting everything together. I have to put the foam things on the wall because literally there's just a desk in here, um, and it's nice to have that separation. So uh, we're almost done moving into our new place. Um, and, you know, like I said, I'm still working on my office, so we're going to have to try to figure out all that as it goes. If my voice sounds a little weird because of fucking voices bouncing off all, like literally every wall without any anything that used to be in here, like my bed, the TV, just every fucking thing. So that's going to be something that I work on over the uh, next couple of days. So it's going to be probably like a DOJ or two plus Far Cry just to get throughout the uh, week and weekend uh, to Monday. And then after Monday, I should have everything situated. Uh, and then regular con- god damn it. Regular content should be back out on the channel. You know, I want to try to do two videos a day, um, if possible. If not, of course, you know, I'm only human. Uh, but I stuck to that about two weeks ago before I got sick, and then I started to move, and then now we're here. So we're wrapping up this week, um, and things will get a lot better on the end of this week when, uh, Monday rolls around, or when Tuesday rolls around, because, uh, you know, Monday I'm just gonna take to kind of get everything finished up. We'll stream on Monday. Um, and other than that, let's just go ahead and kind of go around in uh, DOJ and get shit popping. See what we can do. We're gonna be using the Ruiner. I just spawned this, uh, like, accidentally and it spawned in white. And I was like, holy shit, that looks really good. So, we're just gonna go ahead and use this. Uh, I'm not gonna register it or anything. We're just gonna act like it's a stolen vehicle or whatnot. Um, there's a few people, a few sibs in game, Rika, Kelly, and all them. Uh, so if we happen to pass by them, we'll pass by them, see what they're up to. Other than that, I'm just gonna go ahead and, uh... Act like a fool. Why is every car alarm going off? Someone bashed the shit out of that car. I'd be pissed. All right, let's go ahead. We're kind of, uh, we're literally where we left off yesterday, uh, on the end of the episode. I love the reoccurring, uh, respawn points, which is nice, because you can, you go, oh, that's what I was doing the last time I was in here. Yep. Uh, but the, the stuff that we've been doing the past couple days, you know, probably besides this, because I don't have much planned, nor do I have much time. Um, is what I want to start focusing on, you know, doing a lot of stuff with the people in DOJ, uh, cause making group content with them is actually pretty fun. Uh, sometimes like, you know, when I get busy or I just really need to get in here and get an episode for tomorrow, I'll get in here and do myself a single player or whatnot. What the fuck, man? Windows. Um, so yeah, I just, uh, I, I love those videos too, and it seems like a lot of people like them. And, uh, last time we did the Patriot reenactment, I'm gonna run this, um, the pink gang actually stepped out of their normal thing that they usually do and uh, went out there and kind of showed us who they were and stuff, which I thought was fun. Um, but yes, definitely, definitely a lot of stuff to look forward to. I'm going to start thinking of weird things to do like that. Things that I, well, of course we did that before, but I think the second one was a lot more enjoyable. Um, you know, just a big group of people and it was kind of chaotic at some points, but it was definitely good. Definitely, definitely good. Absolutely hilarious. Uh, the past like three episodes, I've I la laughed my ass off, and it's been great. Um, <clears throat> so there's going to be probably a lot more streaming. I like how I said I'm going to run the last one, but I'm not going to run this one. So there's probably going to be a lot more streaming going on, too. Because I'm going to bring uh, my secondary computer over to my new place. So that way I could stream there. Rich lives there, and uh, so does my other friend, who's going to start streaming as well, too. So it's going to be a whole bunch of people streaming. I'll be able to literally yell at them. Ah! literally yell at them i'm driving like a jackass while i'm in the house so <laughs> that'll be great jesus christ uh, it'll be a definitely interesting experience so where the fuck are we gonna go let's see i don't know where people are at i don't know where the most people are at right now i would assume everyone is in like the pink gang likes to harbor themselves and uh they're not even a gang they say they're their organization which that's the same shit as a gang if you ask me um they like to harbor themselves in Blaine County. Every time I usually saw him was out in Blaine County. So we'll just go and kind of just peek at what people are doing. I'm gonna kill that person. Ooh, that was so close, dude. That was so close. I hella want to play LSPDFR, though. Like, I put that out yesterday, and I just... 
Oh, it was so good. It was, it's been so long, except for that fucking Explorer I have in there. I don't know if you guys watched that video, but the fucking Explorer. Oh my god, the million problems in one that literally had a shell that was moving up and down. Oh, so bad, so bad. I'm gonna take that one out and try to fix it or just replace it with a different one. But I've been loving LSPDFR. I want to try to get out there. Oh, you so motherfucker. Just like real life. Just like real life. No, you get the fuck over here. You're gonna die now, bitch. Please don't be a cop. I need a fucking revenge. The car, it's a red sports car. Oh no. No, I don't have a gun. Fuck, it's gonna have to go down old school. And this car's a bitch compared to that car. He knows he fucked up too. All right, just please don't be any cops because we're gonna do some jank shit. That's what happens when you fuck with the wrong person? That nose pit training. Ah, uh, bitch. Oh, <laughs> his head bouncing around in that motherfucker. Oh yeah, what's up? You like that, bitch? We're gonna keep going. My car is fucked. It hasn't taken any damage. I forgot to get gas. This motherfucker start, might start taking off now. Oh shit. Oh shit. I don't think he saw that. We're still going for our kill. I don't have any weapon. I might have a knife, actually. I'm gonna take that back. I might have a knife, but that's gonna be impossible to use if we're in a vehicle. We're gonna go for another pit here. Ooh. Oh shit, son. That, that one was hella good. Oh, okay, you're gonna get the fuck out of the car, motherfucker. You're not gonna do that to me. Get away with it, bitch. It's a freeway kick down. And I'm gonna kick my own car. Fuck you. Stay on the ground. Oh, no. Oh, no. Fuck you, bitch. You dead? You gonna get the fuck up? Handle your own? Nope, you're dead. Let's all remain calm. Don't tell me to remain calm. <laughs> That's perfect. Uh, let me just fix it so I can get to the fucking mechanic shop. Because this isn't good. I just beat someone down on the freeway. Like, what the fuck? Classic LA shit right there. What the hell? Alright, so, wait, what do I- Oh yeah, I probably just have a cursor to Blaine County. I was like, what did I put a marker to? Um, so yeah, we're gonna go get our car fixed, and then we'll roll through, like, uh, Sandy Shores, Yellow Jack, and all that stuff, just to see if people are over there. God damn, dog. Over there barking like a madman and shit. Let's see. I gotta try to get around the- Actually, isn't there a mechanic? No, uh, just a gas station. I am gonna need gas, too, but they got a gas station right next to the mechanic shop, so we might as well just go down there. I only saw one highway patrol. Huh. I really want to do some jank shit around people, but... Then again, I also don't, but I do, but I don't. Alright, let's go ahead and get down to the mechanic shop so I can fix this shit up and kind of see what other people are up to. Hopefully we don't get any more fucking fist fights on the way. We're pulling up to the uh, mechanic shop right now. We're gonna go ahead and get this fixed and we're gonna go roll back through Joshua down on that side. I haven't seen one Blaine County Sheriff since I've been here. I had to pull over on the side of the road back there to respond to a text message. Don't want to make sure the house is on fire over there, so let me go ahead and get... Did I get gas? Ah, fuck it, I'll get gas first and then I'll get it fixed. I really hope it doesn't take my gas away when I fix the car, though. We should probably get a gun, too. If we got into it with someone on the freeway here, we might want to get a gun. I don't really know where my fucking guns went in the first place. I think the last time we... I ditched all my weapons was when I did that, uh... Uh, Halo Saint episode where we set up the bank heist. I think I ditched all my weapons so that way I couldn't be accused of anything. Alright, slash fix. That car is fucked in the front. Holy shit. I wish the only thing about this car, which I tried to do when uh, I, I got into it, um, I wish the headlights went up. You know what I mean? Like in Bugs' Miata or something like that, where the headlights will pop up old school status. Uh, like if you just turn them on, it's just regular lights that come on. I, I can see that they are obviously exposed, but it, it looks like they're supposed to move. What the fuck? I want to get in on this. Hey man, your horn sounds like a piece of shit. <laughs> what did you say about my horn? Your horn sounds like a piece of uh, shit. <laughs> Why did you call my horn that? Because it sounded like a piece of shit. I heard so it halfway down the road. Like? My horn sounds like a big, uh, fuck you. That's what it sounds like. <laughs> uh, yeah, my horn's pretty fine. Hey, you want to get your ass kicked? I don't got any fucking weapons, but I'll still beat that ass all up and down the street. Oh, I no. Money. I got a oh. musket, bitch. I do got a weapon. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> oh, I just shot... <laughs> 
<laughs> he's not even gonna check on him. He's just gonna instantly pursue me. That's fucking great. <laughs> Shot him in the back with a musket. Who the fuck does that shit? Oh, I do. Oh, musket killer. Jesus. That's fucking great. <laughs> Oh, don't kick my car, you won't get shot down. I was like, I don't even got a weapon, but I did. I did have a weapon. That's so good. And I'm gonna be in full-on chase mode. The guy knows what I look like because I had to run back to my car. Fuck me. We're gonna have to change our clothes and steal another car. Is he chasing? I don't think he is following me, to be honest. I don't know where he's at. Nice. So he just fucking shot. <laughs> Guy talked mad shit. I mean, hey, it is a roleplay server, so if you want to talk shit and turn your back on someone and act like you're just going to go to the bank after you kick someone's car, you got me fucked up. Oh my god, that's great. I love how the cop was like, yeah, well, I just heard gunshots. Someone probably just got shot to death, but I'm not even going to check to see that. We're just going to chase a suspect. <laughs> oh, that's so good. We got a car up here. We're going to take this. Oh, it's a Sultan, too. Nice. Yeah, we'll ditch this on the side of the road, because we're hot as fuck now. I gotta go to a closed store also. Oh, it was just totally unlocked. Nice. Alright, close, close, close. We should probably go out to the city. Because I don't think I'll be- Oh, no, here. We'll go here. Yeah. Nice. That is what I'm talking about, dude. Okay, so we can drive like a jackass for a little, but uh, until we get kind of a little closer to that closed store, we're just not- mm, Not a good idea. But, uh, we gotta change our clothes. Once we change our clothes, we'll be good to get back into Blaine County. I wanna go... We're in Blaine County, actually. Uh, no, we're not. We're in Los Santos County. Interesting. Uh, so, once I change my clothes, we're gonna get back to Blaine County. I wanna look and see if I actually killed him. I know the game registered as a kill, but I shot him in the back, so I wanna see if he's, like, role-playing it out, and he's gonna throw out a description on me. I don't know. I just... I'm curious to see if they're even gonna help the guy out. I mean, shit, all I wanted to know why his horn sounded like a piece of shit. I heard that shit all the way down the road, and it was going, meh, meh, like weird-ass shit. I don't know what it was doing. Definitely not meh. I don't know what that was, but... <laughs> he did. Uh, he deserved it, though. Absolutely, 110%. I would, if I had to replay that situation over again, I would have shot him in the head. That way, I know I left no witnesses. Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's so good, though. It's not like we just pulled out a gun and shot him in the back. We took out a fucking musket. A fucking musket. And then I even reloaded. <laughs> I poured my powder. I fucking packed the fucking gun, the little ball, that's great. Oh, man. All right, we're near the closed door, so they're probably gonna have cops all up and down this bitch, so let's, uh, play it cool until I change my clothes. All right, let's see here. Oh, man, that was- what the fuck was that? That car just bounced. Um, yeah, I want to try to get there quick, though, because I really want to get back to the scene and see what's going on. But this guy's deciding to drive 30 miles per hour in a fucking 45, so you all I got is a fucking well I got a actually I got like a I got like a musket pistol if that makes any sense like you got it loaded and packing and shit um remember last time I came here I parked back there and a cop rolled up it was like what the fuck are the chances of that I don't know if many of you remember that yeah you guys probably would that shit was intense this is a gun store what are you doing I do gotta get I want a, I want an actual pistol though so that way, if I do gotta shoot someone down again, I can do it like a gangster, and not like a fucking jackass. Uh, I even fucking screamed out, you got shot with a musket! <laughs> oh, it's so good, on so many levels. Alright, let me go ahead and just use... I don't- I don't got time to sit there and make a new outfit through that, so fuck it. I wonder I have- do I have this guy without... I don't mind that, uh... Outfit. Let me just take this mask off. I think it's under beard. I never roll around with a mask on. I don't know. I just feel like it totally takes me out of like a roleplay element. I don't know why. Just because I in real life I never walk around with a mask on. So I guess maybe that's just not me. Uh, let me just change the upper. Take off these gloves. I don't want to look like a badass. I mean we already got to shoot someone with a musket. We know we're a badass. We don't got to prove anything. There we go. I want to save this too. Nice looking. The normal outfit when you want it to be, and then it could be also a very bad outfit when you want it to be with the fucking mask on it. Alright, and then we'll go and get, uh, I'm gonna remove the musket and, uh, the other handgun. Oh, someone got hit by a car over. Uh, that way, in case the cops search me, I don't have the fucking gun that I just murdered someone with. Alright, F5. 
weapons, remove all weapons, and then we're just going to get a, a combat pistol with a flashlight. Why not? There we go. That way, that way we would shoot someone down, we do it like a real man with, <laughs> with a new age gun. That, that makes no sense. It makes it no, no better at all. No better. Murder's murder. All right, so let's get gas, and then we're going to head back. I'll probably get it right outside of Harmony there. Ooh, fuck me in the arse. Ooh, play it cool, play it cool, play it cool. I got a gun on me, though. You don't want to fuck with me. And I love this guy. He's probably going to try to get me for crossing over a double uh, yellow, but you can actually cross over a double yellow from and uh, entering a driveway. Actually, you might not be able to cross over the double yellow entering the driveway, but you can sure as hell cross over the double yellow exiting a driveway. Um, just because if not, you'd be locked into one way and leaving, and that would be kind of shitty. So they do have cops prowling areas that I wouldn't think that they would be prowling, but that's probably the same guy that came and rolled up me on the back of the fucking store last time when I was over there. Uh, so yeah, we're going to head to Harmony. I'm going to see what the fuck's going on. See if they got cops all up and down that bitch. Um... And if there's a witness, maybe we could work on taking that guy out. I mean, or he could just apologize for kicking my car. I'm not going to apologize for shooting him because that was a complete self-defense. No, it wasn't. He wasn't even facing me. <laughs> I love it. He was like in there. I don't understand what was going through his brain, though. Like, how are you going to kick someone's car and then not expect that person to want to pull out some type of weapon and fight you or just fight you in general? Like, I didn't think I was going to pull out a gun because I thought I didn't have any. But then as soon as the musket came out, I was like, yep, we're going for it. We are fucking going for it. That is the weirdest antenna on this car. If they didn't put that little, like, wire thing, it would look really good. It would make the car look a little more new age. But because they put that fucking antenna, you're like, what the hell's going on? All right, I'm going to get gas here. Hopefully this guy turns. You going to turn? Yeah. Someone was using the blinkers, too. I don't know what the fuck. Are they up here? Yeah. They are. Okay, that's cool. Nice. Right, let's go ahead and get gas. I could use a blinker and that could, that will make me blend in even more. You know what I mean? That would really make me blend in. Because I saw one Civ using the fuck out of blinkers. I was like, god damn, that's some tedious ass shit right there to click a blinker every time. Like, I don't have it on my controller, so I just, it's, I gotta reach up to the keyboard. Um, yeah, but in real life, you just have your hands on the fucking steering wheel and you can flick it with your finger and you're like, alright, it's all good. But I'll use it. I didn't even use it leaving the fucking driveway. In a, in a video game, I just don't think of a blinker. Like, every video game you play, blinkers are just not a thing. They're like, yeah, we know they're playing a video game, so why why have them run a blinker? But we're going to try. That's a sieve. Just by the way they're driving, you can tell they're sieve. Or maybe not, because that's the same car. Hey, jackass, learn how to fucking drive. Jesus, took down the fucking stop sign. I always told the city they shouldn't have a stop sign there anyways. That guy clearly agreed with me, so... I like to see him cleaning up the streets. Should be down here somewhere at the bank. We're not too far away. I know there's going to be cops all up and down this bitch, so let's not get crazy with our driving or speeding or anything like that. That might be one. Nope. I'm going to pull across the street in the uh, mechanic shop. That would probably be the best thing for me right now because they got cops out here like a motherfucker, dude. Uh, US 11 North, expect delays due to truck convoy. Oh shit, we can go check that out. I'm gonna turn this on. Come, come help me, uh, come help me move him. Oh, he's okay. down. He's down. I wonder if I'll be able to hear what's going on. I think they're in the transporting stage where they're just gonna move the body because he's either shot or... Hey, yeah, you can turn the blade. I thought it's supposed to turn back off once you turn. This is how it goes. People always coming back to the scene of the crime. That's them moving him. He's not walking. But we don't have a... A script where we can actually, like... Move a dead body, per se. And medical must be busy, because, uh... They are straight transporting that motherfucker. And wasn't it a highway patrol that chased me? I could have sworn it was. Ooh, that dude's smashing. Smashing. All right, US 101 North. What did they say? US North 13 or something? I don't know where the fuck that truck convoy is going on, but I can almost guarantee it's Rika. I don't know. 
Uh, I can look at the 13 just to see what's going on. Clearly this guy got shot dead. I wonder who did that. Couldn't have fucked with him. I heard it on the news. Okay, what is that? Is that the fucking... I'm gonna buy some candy. This guy's always had some good candy. What the fuck is he doing? Does he have a mask on? Oh man, there's another person rolling up. He might want some candy. Are you sure you want any? I specifically pulled over just for candy. Hey, I recognized uh, I your car. Person, sir. I recognized your car. You got the candy, right? Yeah, I got candy. You want some? Sure. Yeah, that sounds kind of weird, but uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, what kind of candy would you like? Yeah, whatever you got, man. I got fifty dollars to spend on the candy. Hey, it might be a fruit stand, but they could get All salty right. here, okay? I got some. G Eli B Lies, uh, Toots Eye Rolls. I have no idea what kind of candy this is, Leafy dude. Peeps. Oh, shit. Anything you want, man. Yep, bag it up. 50. I need 50 bucks worth. And let me get some apples, too. All right. I, I don't sell apples, man. You can ask this dude right here. Well, bag them up in it. Uh, all right. I mean, you're working at the fruit stand. You got to be able to, like, handle the fruit. I don't think he works there, dude. Well, then he he's on some next level shit then, I guess. I think I'm gonna sneak into the 27 right. to say I'm working. There you go, sir. I mean, hey, if they pay you, they pay you. Alright, man, how much is it? Uh, you said ask for $50 worth, so that's $50 worth right there. Alright, well, if I All die right, on this shit, I, I got someone that's gonna come back and kill you. This better be legit. Oh, yeah, send him better... to me then. Oh, you don't, why? You, you think he's gonna buy candy after he kills you? Yeah, dude, I can sell him candy. <laughs> this motherfucker. All right, well, this better be good. You have a good one. <laughs> Motherfucker. <dude. laughs> they just stare at me. What the fuck? Oh, he's smashing. Damn, they're smashing. Do you think I'm actually selling fake candy? What do you think this is, huh? <laughs> do you think I'm selling fake candy? What the fuck? Yeah, I definitely need, man. You want some candy? Oh, that's fucking great. All right, so let's go ahead. There's hella... Th so that trash truck, I believe that was probably Rika. You know she loves that junkyard over there. She's over there 110% on that junkyard. Um, let's swing by the junkyard just to see if there's like uh, this, like the typical, all the cars that Rika would spawn in there. See what we got going on. If that was the case, if there, if there is, then that was totally her in that fucking trash truck. I'm just, I'm, I'm guessing. But there's civs everywhere. That's why I like it when there's a lot of civs because you could just, you randomly, I haven't used a civ locator at once and we've actually ran into civs. But if you go into the city, you really just don't have that, go around me bitch, I dare you. Uh, you just don't really have that same dead, same ability to see sieves like uh, you would like. Come on, dude, keep it up. So yeah, we're gonna swing by the junkyard really quick. I'm gonna see what the hell is in the junkyard just to see if like Rika's roll. Yep, yep. Literally, I love when I get fucking call it. That's so good. I love when I know people. <laughs> that makes me feel so good. Oh shit, totally tricked out. Totally tricked out. That's how you know Rika's in game. <laughs> I love it. You got your trash trucks, you got your cement trucks, your uh, like haulers and the dirt trucks, you got your uh, contractor trucks and your forklifts, and they're all green. She does a really good job at making this place come alive. This is the type of civilian stuff I like because then she'll get out here and she'll work all the different types of stuff like the trash truck and all the different cars I mentioned, she'll do the contractor work, and it just makes it so you see a little more stuff going on. Then you guys have the people at the fruit stand, who's one guy always sells candy, and it's just, it's a nice diversity uh, going on. So that was definitely Rika, so that's awesome to see uh, some of that stuff. Oh! But the cool thing is, she can actually go and start a job with, like, the trash delivery and have it cycle and actually go pick up trash in her cars if she wanted to, uh, which is kind of cool. So, definitely up in the up. I want to check out Sandy Shores, but before that, just want to go ahead and look at a few more messages in the phone, and we'll be good to go. Oh shit, dude's on fire! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Are you alright? Oh my god! I don't have a fire extinguisher, I don't have a fire extinguisher! Oh my god! Oh my god! Dude! Are you okay? Stay away from your car! Stay away from your car! Oh, okay, I got you, bud. I got you. Gotta put this shit out. 
Oh no, accidental discharge. That's what he said. God damn it, dude. All right, well, we did our part as a good citizen, okay? That's pretty much all we can do. Uh, but now I'm gonna get the fuck out of here before someone tries to blame me about that. That's not what I want. Uh, so we're gonna roll through Sandy really quick just to see what the hell's going on. Uh, if there's anyone down there doing anything. Um, like I said, kind of a lighter episode today. Just, uh, you know, we had a little bit of summon, a little bit of a chase there. We got to interact with a few civs. I had to keep it light just because of all the moving stuff going on. What's going on here? Let's have a race. Want a race? That was probably the guy I shot earlier. <laughs> He's probably not even there. I'm not gonna stick around. Oh shit, that looked like the guy. It's the same guy, son of a bitch. Please don't chase me. Don't make me kill you again, fucker. Don't make me kill you again. Oh, I wonder if he knows where I went or not. Probably not. Probably not. I could have waited like a couple more seconds and he would have actually responded, but I wasn't sure if he was there or what the hell was going on. And then I realized I kind of recognized his clothes and I was like, uh oh, oh my God, you are going to die. You are going to die. Yep. Drive by. Oh, fuck, dude. What happens when you shoot your own car? Can't shoot your own glass. We gotta steal another car, because this one's not gonna last that long. <laughs> Damn it, dude. I've shot a lot of people in this episode that weren't even real, because they just deserved it. We're gonna ditch this shit right here. I just gotta go... We gotta steal someone else's car, but I gotta get the fuck out of there. I literally just shot someone dead again. Actually, I shot a, I shot a civilian. And... Or no, I shot a uh, AI. And then I shot a civilian with a musket. And then I shot, and these are all civilians too on bikes. What the fuck? What the fuck? And then, uh, oh what? shit. Excuse me? Did I, hold on. Hold on, I wanna hear them. I wanna hear what they're saying. Can you all pull anyone candy? Yo, bitch, I, I got guns. Candy. What the candy? fuck are you doing over here? Mine, they know. Oh, about, my God. They melt. Oh, God. Get the so fuck out of really here. Out. No one gives yeah. a shit. Hey, no one don't come toward me like that. Oh! Don't come toward me like that. Man, let's settle this with Candy, oh man. Yo, can we settle this with Candy? I just shot him again. I just shot him again. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah. Oh, fuck, dude. Oh, shit. Guns were pulled. People were shot. Oh, fuck, dude. <laughs> Oh, fuck, don't fuck it. That was like a big-ass brawl that just happened, and then I was like, of course someone has to pull out a gun. Like, we're in fucking <laughs> Los Santos. What the fuck? Oh, I had to. That cop's so focused on that shit, though, that he's not gonna come looking for me. I'll tell you that shit. But we gotta get the fuck out of here as far as we can go. Ooh, we got cars. Ooh, helicopters rolling in. Helicopters rolling in, dude. Go, go, go. Get in this car. There we go, baby. You got this. There we go. We got to bounce back to Los Santos. We did way too many murders out here in one day to feel comfortable. <laughs> like, shit, dude. I murdered that guy in front of the cop and he was getting his face stomped in by someone else. Holy shit, dude. Play cool. Oh, yeah. They got cops rolling in. Play cool. Okay, we're good. Dude, helicopters. Helicopters. Because I saw him starting to fuck with all those other people on bikes. Like, this dude's on a roll. He started fu I mean, I only walked up the first time to ask him what was up with his horn. Like, I just was, like, joking. Like, what the fuck is up with your shit-ass horn? Because it sounded weird because of the lag. Um, and then dude kicks my car, gets shot dead. Um, then I roll up and ask if the guy wants to race, and then he doesn't answer, and I do a U-turn. And then he chases me down, and then gets into it with some fucking people on a bike. And they pull a knife, and then he punches one of them. And then I roll up and I start shooting people because why not? Why not shoot people? I mean, fucking A. Jesus Christ, dude. That is insane. What the hell? Episodes like that that are random are always good because we got into it with the same guy over and over. Even though technically 
I don't know how he fixed himself up that quick. Unless, oh no, he was role-playing a different guy, I think. Because his character sounded different, if I'm not mistaken. Or if not, they got some really good medical teams out in Los Santos or Blaine County that can patch a motherfucker up from a uh, gunshot wound in the back. A musket gunshot wound. I don't know if that would... Would that be worse? Or not as bad as, like, a bullet from today? I'm, I'm not sure. I really couldn't tell you. I, I have no I have no knowledge on that uh, subject at all, so who knows. Um, but other than that, like I said, they operated on his ass really good. And we've probably taken all the cops from Blaine County and put them out in uh, Sandy Shores right there. So, yeah, that's one way to do it. That's one way to... And now we're back on the same road that I think that we killed that person on in the first place, if I'm not mistaken. No, I don't think so. No, we were on the freeway the first time. Okay, yeah. This is a road we haven't been on yet. So we'll take this back till we get into uh, Los Santos and uh, try to get back to the house without getting caught up or hopefully getting into an accident. This car is a fat piece of shit, but at least we were able to make it out. The fact that that dude did not see me take out a gun and shoot that other guy on the floor at point blank range a couple times just doesn't make any sense to me. Like, what was that cop focusing on? Like, there were shots fired. He rolled up and he was on scene while I was shooting. I heard the sirens, so he must have saw what the hell I was doing. There's no way he didn't see what I was doing. Um, I, I really don't know. I, I could not tell you what the hell was going through that cop's head. Or he was just like, yeah, let's not chase after the guy that just pulled a gun and shot that guy dead. Because if he would have done that, I would have had to have used that weapon more. I would have had to do what I had to do. Please don't be any fucking cops. That's how you get pulled over. Doing jank shit. Okay, we're all good. God damn it. Usually cops sit here, so I don't want to do any jank shit and then get picked up. This dude's going hella slow, though. Okay, we're gonna pass him. Oh, that's a nice car. That's a fast one. This thing is so slow on low end that it's just it takes forever to speed up to where you feel like you can pass a car legitly, not like you're gonna die. All right, we should be good. We're literally gonna do some jank shit. Fuck the stop sign. I told them they should have never put it there. No one stops. God damn, we can't even make it up a hill. Okay, home sweet home almost. We are uh, one turn away from the house, and we were able to have a pretty jank day. I will tell you that. There was not much money to be made. It was pretty much taking care of vendettas and, like, just letting people know not to fuck around. You know what I mean? Don't you drive like a jackass, or I will kill you. Don't you kick my car, or I will kill you. The simple rules of do not... He did, and he should not have, because then he got motherfucking killed. Not just once, not twice, and got his ass beat. Like, what the fuck? Oh, man. That is great. All right, everyone. Like I said, it's going to be a little slower and a little quicker uh, for these episodes for the next couple days, just so I can get through it uh, and try to get to Tuesday, which will make things a lot easier. Uh, I appreciate your guys', you know, uh, understanding on the whole situation and all your guys' support that you've given me on Twitter and all that and Instagram. Absolutely love it. You guys are amazing. Uh, thank you guys so much again. We will see you next episode. <laughs>